All right, guys, check this out. Check this out. We are getting loaded with slime balls right now, guys. So yeah, hey guys, what's going on? This is Beyond Thrower here. Oh hey, what's going on? <laughs> what's going on? Um, Iron Golem. Oh my gosh, I hadn't checked it for that long. We are loaded with slime balls. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, we are. That's what we're doing. Getting loaded with slime balls. So um, oh, is it turning nighttime? Yes, it is. So we can turn off this dang rain. Let's get rid of this rain. So anyway, guys, yeah, welcome back to an episode of Piano Plays Minecraft. It's Piano Thrower here, and let's quickly sleep to get rid of this rain. So. Um, we're in a new snapshot today, guys, and yeah, there's a little bugs. Uh, there's little bugs with the snapshot. Um, this being one of them, yes, it's very, very weird. I don't know exactly what's going on. Actually, is this missing some stone, some cobblestone stairs? I think it is. Do we have any extra? I don't think I need to do that right now. But yeah, guys. Um, so there is some, yeah, yeah, bugs, glitches going on right now. Uh, it's not that big of a deal. They will be fixed next episode. Or hope not. Not it. Yeah, next episode probably. So uh, real quick, guys. I don't have any diamonds on me, so I quickly want to go enchant a uh, diamond pickaxe real quick because I got the levels. Uh, you may be wondering how I got all the levels. Uh, I've been AFK farming, fish farming for a very long time. I've been AFK fish farming for about three nights now. So, um, oh, it's not bad. It's actually a really good working pick. I'll take that. Thank you. So, yeah, I've been AFKing for three or four nights now. And, um, you guys might be wondering what's going on right here. Um, okay, so there was a thunderstorm. There was a thunderstorm the other night here in Minecraft. And I think it caught fire to the horse stables. And I think it might have killed Dusty. It might have killed Dusty. Might have killed Dusty, and it burnt down half of the horse stables, which is not good, obviously. It's not good. But, um, yeah, we're gonna definitely going to have to fix that in the future. But that's not the main topic of the episode today, guys. I really, really want to get down into it and uh, show you guys the main part of this whole entire episode. Real quick, guys, before we start it, I need to start my timer because I always forget to set a timer. But um, it has to do with the end, guys. As I said, and as we did, I think it was last episode... We were working on the beginning of the end portal, and I was working a lot off of camera. That is why there hasn't been an episode out in a while. Um, I have been AF, not AFKing, well, one, I've been AFKing, but um, I've also just been working on the Enderman farm, the Ender Ender, for quite some time now, because obviously you guys do not enjoy, um, I mean, most people do not jo enjoy, um, you know, just me building up and up layers after layers of um, Enderman spawn platform. So obviously it's not the most ideal or fun situation. So um, I don't know if I should be coming over here. Maybe. Um, I really just want to show you it, guys, just to show you it, and then we'll get on to new stuff today. So let me quickly head to the end, guys, and I'll meet you guys down there. One second. Alrighty, guys. So we're in the Nether as of the moment. As you guys can see, there's a crap ton of Enderman. There's a lot of Enderman here, um, but yeah, as you guys can see over here, um, so the old Ender Ender is over there. I think I just looked at an Enderman. Nope, I'm good. So the old Ender Farm is over there, the fail one, and um, yeah, we don't use that anymore, obviously. So yeah, I got myself a little more acquainted here. As you guys can see, I have a lot of stuff. I'm going to grab Ender Pearls right here just in case. Um, but yeah, I got a really, a, I got a situated a lot. I got um, a lot of stuff done off of camera. Um, I don't have that much iron anymore, though, so that is a problem, obviously, so we're going to have to figure out a good way to get iron again, but I want to quickly show you guys this, um, see if I can drop down here without dying, um, quickly, there we go, ow, okay, we're good, <laughs> but if we head down here, I think you'll start to see it, maybe, oh, there we go, so as you guys can see, I've added a couple layers on so far, and yeah, it's working out pretty well for me, I still need to add a couple more layers, like, I don't know, I think I'm at five or six layers, so I think I'm going to add like five or six more layers just so we can get a lot of efficiency. Uh, but I also need to grab buckets of water and stuff like that so I can put water on the top and make sure that uh, the Endermen don't teleport or spawn there. So basically, I'm just going to throw an Enderpearl in here and basically we're inside. So I don't have everything done. Obviously, this roof is not complete, but basically the Endermen are going to fall and we're just going to one hit him. Oh, this guy's not one hit. Huh. Okay, so I think that guy teleported from up top. I think that's the only way that'd be possible. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. As you guys can see, it's, it's not done yet. Um, I think Endermen are actually spawning up top here. That is probably why. Also, they might be spawning 
up top and then before they get hit by the piston they're gonna teleport down into that i think that might be the problem but um most of them like because obviously it's not done but most of them are one hit besides the ones right here but uh basically you can just spam it like this and it'll be pretty much all good yep see and then this will get uh, so much xp it's ridiculous so there we go and we can just run in and collect all the inner pearls and stuff like that and we'll be fine so i wonder if i want to show you guys the um up top because it is kind of hard to get to um i might i'll try we'll see hold on get rid of that thank you and let's just start mining up but yeah see i think the innermen are spawning on top of here and that way they have full health so obviously um it's not fully working right now see that one is not working can i kill you oh no i'm gonna die no i'm fine don't even worry about it all right we're good so let's quickly see if i can get up here all right i'll work all the kinks out don't even worry about it guys so let's see if i can stack up here here we go all right so um yeah as i said i'll try and fix it as much as possible hopefully we'll get this fixed by next episode i don't have the uh, required materials to fix it all up today and get the whole thing up and running but um so far i think it's working out pretty nicely we're not done though we're obviously not done so i think how far up is this i think it's either 48 or 43 i forgot because that's the intermittent's uh fall height i believe is 48 or 43 Ooh, that was a big spawn okay never mind let's keep building up there we go and that is also another reason why my xp is so high up is because i've obviously been uh punching intermittent for a fair amount of time so it's pretty much i mean it's obviously functional now it's obviously getting us one um one hit intermittent but uh, I want it to be all one hit all the time, so we don't have to worry about hitting them with swords, which we'll fix in the future, which will be done. Um, it just might take a little bit just because we don't have the required materials. I'm going to get a lot more stone bricks and stuff like that. And once we have all of those uh, materials set up, then we'll be pretty good. So if you guys are wondering about how this all works, so basically, oop, this intermittent's kind of, there we go. And falls, there we go. All right, so, um... Basically, the innermen get pushed, they spawn on the pressure plates, then they uh, get pushed off onto the, um, what's it called, what's it called, the vines, yes. They get pushed off onto the vines, uh oh, I just moved my mic a lot, sorry about that guys. But um, yeah, they get pushed off onto the vines, and basically the vine serves as the dropping point, because this is 48 blocks up, and so you can add as many layers, actually how many layers do I have, I have one two three four five so i have five so far and um basically ooh, that airman's kind of glitched out but also obviously um they can also spawn right here i need to patch it up so it's all i'll show you guys the full thing when it's done um obviously i'm getting some slip ups obviously it's not the best example because um the internet normally don't do what you know they're told so anyway uh if we go up a little bit more i want to see if i can get this um right there there's just another it's just these uh same spawn platforms if you uh you know oh no i'm dead i'm dead i'm dead Woo! oh i love my life that was wonderful <laughs> oh dang it you gotta be kidding me all right guys one second ah you see how effective this farm is guys it's so effective that i got into it <laughs> um let's see if i can get in here yes oh no it's other side oh there's my stuff quick grab it we'll be good don't even worry about it there we go Collect it all. Oh, man, that was... <laughs> oh, how did I die there? It's fine. It's fine. It's cool. Whatever. 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 It's fine. All right. Um, let's quickly rearrange my inventory for a bit. Give me a spoon. Give me an axe. Give me a knife. That's not a knife. We'll roll with it. It's fine. Um, but I think we're good. But yeah, guys, you guys pretty much get the, uh, the gist of it. There we go. There we go. Uh oh, this guy's. There we go. All right. So anyway, um, I feel like I was quiet for a second, like too quiet. Anyway, um, so that's pretty much it for the Enderman farm, guys. I obviously need to add more. I want to take a picture real quick of it um, before we go, just so we can get a good representation of what we're looking at here. Um, oh god. Okay. No, we're fine. Um, oh no, don't touch me. Okay, so I think I'm gonna let it build up, and then that will be our perfect spot to take a picture. Um, so, uh, yeah, let me AFK here for one second. Alrighty, so it built up. Let me get a good picture of this. Um, oh, God, they are all after me. That's fine. That's fine. Um, there we go. Um, 
There we go. Perfect pictures. Okay, so. They obviously hate me. Let's kill him. Oh gosh, this is gonna take a while to kill him probably. Because some are, um... Some aren't... Like, some don't have, like, low health, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So... Actually, wait, let's see if I can kill them all off. I think I'm fine. Oh god. How many here want to kill me? Okay, a lot want to kill me. Alright, I think I'll be fine. I think I'm good. Okay, so, no one to kill me now. Uh, see if we can find a good source of food real quick. Apples, that's fine. Okay. Uh, hi. Okay. <laughs> but I think we're good here. F I think I'm good here for today. Uh, see if I can teleport out of here without killing myself. Um, real quick. Real quick. Please don't die. Oh, gosh. Quick, get your sword out. Okay. I think we're good. Okay, awesome. So... Um, as we're heading back here, I also need to um, extend this walkway, guys, because you guys can see it's very sketchy, very rickety. I don't think I want to deal with that. So, yeah, we're going to have to fix that later. But uh, I don't think we're going to do this for that episode. I might do it all. Oh. <laughs> Why is this snow golem throwing snowballs off the edge? You're supposed to be killing the Enderman. Uh, hop. Oh, perfect. Okay. Uh, wait, do I have my armor on? So these chain boots have feather falling. Um, I didn't even enchant them. I came with a skeleton, I believe, which is a crazy drop. I don't even know. But yeah, chain boots with feather falling. Imagine it. So um, as well as over here, I put um, snow golems over here. Um, I don't know exactly what he's doing now. Oh, I guess he's throwing snowballs at him. That's fine. Um, so I got one right here, and I think, I don't know where the other one is, but I put two snow golems um, in this world. Don't know exactly where they are. Huh. Well, there's one more somewhere. I don't know where else he is, but um, that, uh, the first one's over there. So let's quickly hop in the portal, guys, um, real quick. And then, so I want to mess around with the banners today. Not the banners. Um, there's, since it is a new snapshot, they added, obviously, some new features. So one new... Oh, wait. Oh, there's the other one. Whoa. There's a weird glitch over there. You guys see that? Whoa. What? You guys see that? I don't know if you guys see that, but anyway, um, let's hop in the portal. There we go. So I don't know exactly know I don't exactly know how to make an armor stand. I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. Um, I haven't really looked at it at all, so I'm just gonna go with it and see if I get it. If I get it, that'll be pretty crazy. So if I get it, if I get it, no. <laughs> Thought I was close. No, probably not. Okay. Nothing? Okay, yeah. Alright, I don't know how to make that armor stand. Um, I'm gonna go quickly check, guys. Hold on. Alrighty, so I got the armor stand. It turns out it was a slab, um, a stick here, stick here, and then up, 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 and then another stick there. So, um, weird, weird crafting combination, but I got the armor stand, guys. So, I do not know where I should put it. Um, if I were to guess, if I were to maybe throw something out there... Uh, I would say maybe at the blacksmith shop because the blacksmith shop, uh, I feel like that would make the most sense, maybe. Um, so let's put it right here. Uh oh, no, let's put it sideways. Um, uh oh, please tell me we can break this. There we go. Um, sideways. There we go. And if we uh, take off our stuff, maybe. Um, okay. Nope. Wait. No, wait. Take that off. All right. And if we put that right here, right click it. Boom. Armor stand. All right. So we get this one. Boom, armor stand. And if you get this one, boom, armor stand. And one more, boom, armor stand. Awesome. That actually looks really nice. Let's take a picture of that. Dink. Awesome. So I wish it was diamond armor, actually. Um, but you know what? It's all right. It's fine. Uh, so if you right-click that, right-click that, right-click that. Um, and come on, can we get the boots? Uh-oh. Can we get the boots? There we go. There we go. Awesome. So... Um, yeah, I've got the armor stand. I know you can do different types of stuff with it, um, such as, you know, like, you can move items. I don't know. It's really difficult. It's like, um, it's definitely not vanilla. It has to do with command blocks and, um, a variety of redstone, but obviously we can't do it in survival. Um, I might mess around with it maybe some other time. I might post a, post a video on it. No idea. Um, speaking of videos, I hope you guys enjoy that uh, the eight tiny details series that I put up on my channel. I, I thought that was actually really um, a good idea, if you guys know what I mean. I thought that was a really good idea, really original idea, and it actually ended up being really um, 
I think a lot of people actually liked it, so uh, probably I might actually do a, another episode of it. Uh, I got a lot of tiny details for you guys that uh, I would like to share with you, I guess. So, uh, yeah, I might do that. I might do a series on that. So I just put leather on here, as you guys can see. But uh, whenever I do get diamond, I might swap it out for diamond. Obviously, I don't have any diamonds. I actually spent my diamonds on a really decent shovel. I had one more diamond, and I spent it on a really decent shovel. I'll show you guys right a second. Um, tools, yeah, look at this. So if you compare these two shovels, um, actually this is the shovel that I enchanted. Um, it's a silk touch, efficiency, and unbreaking, and then this one is efficiency four, unbreaking three, and fortune. So um, if I were to say, let's get both of them out. Let's grab the gravel. So if I were to say grab gravel, so let's see, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. All right, so if I were to use the silk touch one, um, I would get gravel out of it no matter what if I, was looking, if I wasn't looking for flint. And for the fortune one, I would pretty much always get gravel. So I have a decision whether I want to get um, flint all the time or I want to just get regular gravel. So I think that's really cool. Uh, but if I had to choose, I think I would want to get regular gravel first. So I'm going to put the um, the fortune one back. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Fortune three on a shovel isn't, isn't that good. I mean, obviously... Uh, it's good for getting flint for one thing, but I think a fortune 2 will do the job um, No matter what so I don't know uh, but I also went AFKing um, Obviously at the fish farm and I want to go and put a this not this thing um, thorns 2 okay um, So I have a thorns 2 there he is the thorns 2 awesome so I want to go put thorns 2 on these Boots maybe um, do I have any cha other chain boots that I can maybe combine to heal it up um, no, it does not look like it. Alright, so, instead I should probably put them on, okay, so this is Thorns 1, except it's gold. I don't think I want to go with gold, so, um, I'm probably going to go put it on a leather hat, maybe? Yes? Alright, I'm going to go put on a leather hat. Alright, so if we go over here, go to the anvil, uh, I think we'll be good. Let's see, I'll go quick, wait, 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 take off the hat, put the hat in, there we go. What was this, Thorns 2, Blast Protection 2. So that is not bad. It's eight. Um, and the reason I'm not worrying about any enchanting right now, guys, like any enchanting levels, why I'm wasting it so much is because it really doesn't matter. Now that I got the Enderman farm, well, kind of got the Enderman farm, and I also have my, ooh, spider jockey. Wait a minute, I'm going to go kill him. But uh, now that I have my Enderman farm and I have my, what's it called, fishing farm and our skeleton farm, I'm pretty much completely set on XP for now. So... Yeah, um, it's actually been a while since I've actually set up a farm. The one thing, that, the one farm that we do not have, guys. Oh, uh oh, don't hit me. You're hurting yourself, bro. Hit me. Come on, hurts yourself. <laughs> um, but um, there we go. Kill yourself. Awesome. So, uh, what was I saying? The one farm that we do not have in this world, guys, that we should probably get going um, at some point, probably next episode, maybe if we can, uh, would definitely be. What is that? Is that pants? What kind of pants? I think it's just regular golden pants, right? Yeah, that's what it looks like. All right, but yeah, um, I would wonder where we would put such a thing, such a giant mob farm, because um, I kind of want to get a cylinder type of mob farm, maybe somewhere right here or or somewhere by the cactus farm. <gasps> oh, so we can do two things at once. So we can do cactus farming at one spot and mob farming at another, which is actually not a bad idea. So uh, I'll have to think about that for next episode, guys, but... Uh, I don't know how early we're going into the episode. I could even want to check this. Um, let's see. All right, so I think we're almost. I think we're almost. I think we're a little early to be honest for this episode. But uh, I think I might end it off for today, just because I kind of ran out of ideas for today. But um, I'll have to think of some more stuff to do for next episode. But um, I think we accomplished a lot today, guys. I'm really. Um, Good. I'm very glad I showed you guys that. We got the uh, I showed you guys the Interman farm. Uh, played around with the armor stands and yeah, and we also just you know started planning out the mob farm. So um, kind of a lazy day, uh, not much to do. But I hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless. If you guys did enjoy, it, please give it a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Ta-ta! Bye, guys.